week 12's long run saw uh, a 15 kilometer session and I thought I'd put myself through it this week. I purposely chose a route that um, had quite a steep elevation. Now unfortunately the run details don't show any of the elevation at all but I was actually climbing all the way for the first half seven and a half K out and then seven and a half K on the way back down. I also decided, thanks to some um, listening and reading I've been doing this week, to make an effort to focus on my breathing and that really uh, added an, another element of difficulty. Breathing in through my nose only and then out through my mouth, adjusting the pace of my breathing in relation to how much I needed it and even just by focusing on breathing in and out, in through my nose, out through my mouth, I found it quite difficult. I had mentioned last week that I do um, begin my runs a little out of breath anyway. And so I managed to get about 3K into the run of uh, really forcing myself to breathe in and out through my nose. But then as the incline increased, I found it more difficult. So. I was just breathing in and out through my mouth. But then as soon as I turned around um, for the downward journey home, I managed to breathe pretty much all the way home through in through my nose and out through my mouth. I was quite um, happy with the cadence. I thought it was gonna be a lot slower, but it's um, 158, so that's very good. And I thought the tempo was going to be extremely slow as well because I started off very, very slow. Um, but when I've stopped, I've seen that my overall pace wasn't that bad at all. So this is the final time. Here are the splits. That was the end of week 12 training for the Valencia Marathon. It kicks off on the 3rd of December 2023. And I cannot wait.